this part two now. Let me figure this out when we'll get back to this one too. This is making me mad. Why is this supposed to be the Oracle and it doesn't know what I'm typing and thinks I make it a typo? Oh. Okay. Ooh. Look at this chunk of love right here. Hey, you two, look. It's gold tone. It has gold ringies and big gold beads and faux pearls and a lobster claw clasp that is on the brassy side. It's choker length with a huge long choker. I mean, <laughs> extender. No bead on the end though. It might have fallen off. This is very pretty. And that would be four dollars in the necklace department. I wonder about that bracelet um, necklace a lot. Okay, these are really cool looking acrylic beads. They're square. They have marbly, wavy, ethereal looking things in them. That this very lightweight lobster claw clasp with a long extender and a bead on the end. This is the way it looks in the hand. There's the bottom. Yeah. Okay, YouTube, take your shot. And this will be two dollars. I don't. The the weight is so lightweight. I don't. I like stuff that's more meaty. You know. It seems to me more, more, more meat on it, more value. Huh? And this has a string. I don't like strings. Kind of hope this doesn't break. <laughs> okay. So this has been beaded by hand. Maybe my machine. I don't know. You can see, though, the stitches. Wow. That's crazy. And they did this, too. I think this would be more complicated than the wedding dress that I made, the one of them that I made for the Queen Mary. That's really cute. This would be three dollars in the bracelet department. Okay, what is these? Ooh, look at that. Ooh, cool. Look, these are all filigree beads, all kind of ringlet things. Uh, uh, they're acrylic. They're all faceted, though. Can you see that? See the light? Light, 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 light. And these are hammered disc and hammered round things. <laughs> Rings. And more stuff. So when you do that, it shakes. That is so pretty. And it's heavy. Yeah, I mean, I like the weight, you know? It's nice. It's meaty. Cute. And it hasn't lost its color at all. I like the bead caps too. They took time to put nice bead caps on the ends of those. Yep, even, yep. Not you, even these that got bead caps. Nice job. This would be four bucks. And a silver one. Look. Uh oh, I need a lighter. Man, I don't like this. This is not going to poke you, though. This is really soft. I just don't like it sticking out. Why is it sticking out? Why would you do that? Let me see if I can poke it in. Or push it in. Ah, uh, I did. Ha uh, ha. See? Tricky me. I didn't have to cut it. And chance cutting the whole bracelet. This is nice also. This is not, of course, as heavy as the other. But it does have beads and ring ringlets little rings and big rings and things in between. This will be two dollars in the bracelet department. Silver top. Earring, ring, ring, ring. Earring. Tomorrow night is going to be a big night. Probably three videos. That sucker is getting full. The earrings and ring thingies. <coughs> Excuse me. This is rose tone. Just a segundo. 
Okay. Oh, that's cute. Alright. So this is Rose Tone. And it's got one, two, three discs. Well, a ring. A bigger ring. And then this is a disc in the back, but it's kind of in the front. It's kind of second. This is faux jersey. Yellow. Pale yellow. It does look pretty with the rose gold tone. Lobster claw clasp with a bead on the extender. Nice extender also. This is a nice snake chain. Really nice texture. I don't see any signs of wear or maybe right there, but you know what? You can clean that with a with a gold cloth and it will come right off. This is the only sign of wear I see on it, and because it's getting squishy by, by that thing. This will be three bucks in the necklace department. Take a picture. You know what? Watch. It's going to be something goofy. Earring. A frog. Look at him. Made in India. This is, looks like 24 or 22 karat gold. This is really pretty. He looks brand new, and he's a pin. He's not marked, and I'm putting him back in there. I can't tell you till tomorrow. Okay, so there's a wish bracelet, success wish bracelet. Tie this bracelet on and make a wish. While you wear it, success and accomplishment will come to you. Once the bracelet falls off, your wish will come true. Cupcakes and cartwheels. Tell you what, cupcakes and cartwheels, success and, co and accomplishment only come from hard work. But it's a cute idea. It's made out of some kind of straw or... It's like paper. So after it's worn a little bit, it'll fall off by itself. Nice idea, though. That'll be a buck. Don't tell the person you give it to that you have to actually have to do hard work to amount to anything. This is missing a piece, so we will wait. It's a watch. And we will wait to see if we can find the other parts to it. Earring. Crystal Avenue. Prim premium Genuine Brass Hollow Hoop. Huh? You mean Silver Tone Over Brass. Okay. Not for children. I'm taking this package off so I'm going to make noise. Y'all don't like this. Cover yours. I don't like it either. I don't like to make the noise. Okay. So this is what these look like. They're supposed to be hypoallergenic. They're nice hoops. They have a nice weight to them, actually. So let's see if they're brass. Yes, they are. Not magnetic. The silver is really nice on it, actually. The silver tone. Whatever kind of metal it is. They're nice hoops, saddleback closures, that's what these are called, right here. And they're in the earring department anyway, so I'm not talking about them. Let's get some more goodies out here. Because there's a... Oh, it's not broken. Gosh, darn it. What? Okay, you guys are funny. <laughs> There's two lobster... Uh, no, a spring ring clasp and a lobster claw clasp. Together, they're fighting. Or they're mating. I don't know what the deal is. <laughs> Wait. Okay, okay. I'm breathing. Don't worry. Sometimes I hold my breath when I'm doing tangles. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm just strange like that. Okay, so the first chain is a spring ring clasp with the little claspette thingy. It is a tiny curb chain. Silver tone. Looks like it's in good condition. It'll be a dollar. 
in the necklace department. The second one that's wrapped around this bracelet, because they love to wrap around these kind of bracelets. I'm surprised there's not more in here. Get off. Okay. Oh, this one's closed. Lobster claw clasp, Rolo chain, sparkly little booger. It's about regular 18 inches, maybe. It's in great shape also. That'd be a dollar also in the necklace department. And, oh, earrings. No can do. Aluminum and um, is a dollar. All these bangles that are a little like this or, uh, is there any more? Uh, you know, like this, you know, little bitty bangles like that. I always charge a dollar. Oh, that's more than one. Okay. For those of you that are new. Ooh, these are glass. They're heavy. Ow! This chair is not comfortable. I have to get a new... I have to put a new cushion on it. These are real pretty. Look. Can you see? There. It focus finally. It's greens and blues. Real pretty. I love these up here. This is a leather cord. Nice. End caps. Good job. Lobster claw clasp with a little bit of the extender. And this is glass. So, about four bucks in the necklace department. And this is a cute little dilly. Got an angel wing and a heart that says guess. <laughs> this is a guest bracelet, y'all. And a heart with some kind of wannabe shell stuff and a butterfly and a faux pearl and a bow with faux pearls over here okay so which part are you which which part stretches okay <clears throat> so we got lipstick on there <clears throat> excuse me so that's it and it's a guest bracelet so just for fun I'm gonna Take a picture of this little doodad with the little guest thing on there and see if the oracle really is out to lunch today or is just dopey or what. There's the guest. Everybody can see it, right? Yes. Okay. Here comes the oracle. Gonna take a picture. It's not freshwater pearl. Are you silly? No. Okay. Let's just put this in here. Not Gucci. Yes. Bracelet. This is a bracelet. Let me put faux pearl. Hey, come on, man. Okay. G U E S S F A U X P E A R L B R A C E L E T. That's that's almost it. Yeah. $14 up there, so I'll charge 7 I'm always half of what they are, and this is on eBay. So there. I saw that problem. Oh, these are sugar fix. Look at these. And it says sugar fix on the back of the earrings. Oh, we'll get to talk about them tomorrow. Okay, cool. Groovy. I'm tossing all the earrings, pins, pendants. Oh my god, how cute is that? Look at this owl, Mr. Owl. Hold on, let me get get rid of Mr. Pen. 
and a pin. And there's lots of stuff there, right there. Okay. All right. Look at him. He's so cute and he's articulated his little tail and his little body. Look at his eyes. They're so funny. <laughs> he's gold tone. Green, blue, light green. Oh, his head fell. And he's on a weird chain. I don't think this chain went with him. Do you? So fold it, maybe. Fold over clasp. No name. Nuts. Okay. Well, he's adorable. Mr. L is five dollars. This is silver tone and black rhinestones. Can you see it? There you can. They're big and little, big and little. Oh, okay. So the little ones are in a gold cup, gold tone cup. I don't see any writing on here. Tight stretch. I stretch two bucks and this one is some more Swarovski crystals hmm well let's check my theory oh these are silver tone with gold tone in the middle let's see nice and soft Silver is a soft metal. They add different metals to harden it up so it won't fall apart or break easily. That's why you have nickel and zinc and all that jazz in there. Winter, winter, chicken dinner again. Tardar. Okay. Well, that's cool. If you have these nice crystals like this, I want to show you the crystals again. Okay. Look at them, the color, the way they're faceted, the perfection in, in the bicones. Those are bicones. See? Two cones. Bi means two. Okay. They're perfect. The, the faceting, everything is perfect. And that's what you could, how you could recognize a Swarovski crystal. The brightness of the reflect the reflectivity of the st of the stone also. You can buy plastic ones; they're not the same. You can put them up next to them, and then you realize what they are. But these boogers are sterling. Yay! I'm so happy. I found some silver for y'all. Here's a word I bag at. Let me get back over here. Ugh. Man, when you get old, you get crunchy. I gotta tell you about getting crunchy. Okay, so now we got two. Uh, basically the same. I wonder if they came from the same. Hmm. The same person donated them because they're both Swarovski. They're both sterling silver findings. Two bracelets. Five dollar each. Okay? Okay. Not gonna find five dollar anything on anywhere. Especially certainly. Because I am me. Okay, this is a little crocheted bracelet with this is the bead the loop and the bead holding it on. Teeny tiny seed beads and teeny or tiny seed beads. Do you see that? Somebody sewed that. Good night. This is two bucks in the bracelet department. Just because it took a long time to make. Cram and Eddie. Okay, we're almost done out of the box here. We got the smalls broken up. There's some pieces and stuff. I hope I find that those pieces to that. Those two necklaces. Or that one necklace with the two pieces missing. But that's going to be a bummer. That is a beautiful... Wow, look at that. Okay, I make noise. But I'm going to save this and put it back in here. I don't want nothing to happen to this. Th look at that. That is absolutely beautiful. Brush gold here. 
and bright gold hair, gold tone. There is no writing on it. I can't believe it. That's stunning. Okay, I never say that word. I'm putting this back over here. We will talk about it tomorrow. Okay, let me see if I can get rid of some stuff out of here so we can get down to brass tacks. Look at this then. Look at this. We'll talk about this tomorrow too. <gasps> Look at that. That is so cool. This is acrylic. It's a silhouette. That is so cool. Alright, let me get rid of some of this stuff. I'm going to get rid of any. There's something written on here, and I'm not. All I can read is Christ. I'm going to put this over here. Okay. Um, you know, it's been exact. Oh. I found one. Did I find one? No, it's, it's a something, though. A big fat rhinestone for something. Make ring ring go away. Earring go away. Pin go away. House of Lloyd. Okay, somebody. House of Lloyd is in England. What? Okay. I have to investigate that. That's going to be a trip. Like, does that mean, like, House of Lloyd, like Lloyds of London? Really? All right. Well, that's going to be interesting. I'm trying to get these distractions out of here. No, like, distractions. There's another one. Pieces. I want to find that one for this necklace. That's beautiful. That's a piece of artwork. Okay, bear with me, y'all, please. There's another owl. He's so cute. My mommy. Every time I see an owl, I think of my mama. She loved her some owls. She really did. All right, that's better. Oh, there might have been a bracelet in there. There might have been a bracelet that was broken in here or something. Okay, this is a real druzy, my friends. If you look real close, if the light hits it just right, you can see the crystals. I need a flashlight in here. There's t If you got it on the microscope, you could see tiny crystals with points. As a druzy, it's wrapped in uh, copper. This is, uh, I guess, macrame. I think that's what you call it. And it's a Shambhala style closure. This is very pretty. Somebody did a nice job on it. This is the host rock. Host rock means the outside of the rock. I'm bringing my Colombian emeralds. I'm going to smash one on camera. Because I have one pound of Colombian emeralds in the host rock, uncut. You can see the green tint to them on the outside, but I want to open one. I've had it for 20 years. <laughs> oh, this will be $3 in the bracelet department. I want to break one open, and I'm ready. These are... Just as stretchy. Possibly how somebody bought them to use them in jewelry. They're not Swarovski. A dollar. One, one dollar. This looks like a watch band style bracelet. 
good stretch because it's the metal stretch. Be two dollars in the bracelet department. This is a Singapore chain. Okay, education time. Looks like a rope, right? But it's it's around and around and around and around, and it's a like somebody pulled out a rope and stretched it. That's what a Singapore chain is. Oh, it needs a ring. It needs a clasp too. Don't worry. Oh, I just got some new leverback things, by the way. Silver tone, gold tone, rose tone, gunmetal, and brass tone. I think. And one other tone. Five or six in one. This is a full pearl stretchy for a dollar. I could look this up. 